Well, hey there, YouTube. We're uh, going to do a little project here. I'm going to try putting a different type of winch on this here thing. See how this works out. Uh, this winch I'm switching to, it's a 3500 versus a 3000. Um, the biggest deal is, is this one has this knob here. You pull out and try and jam up there and twist for free spool and it just screws on there so if it gets twisted at all like it like it just did to me like that it becomes a real pain in the butt to get the thing engaged again and this has a nice twist a uh, twist uh, clutch to you know a twist knob to engage or disengage but the other thing with that is the mounting plate is just slightly different it might actually still work we'll see I grabbed a drill and and stuff uh, but this looks like it might be the same we'll see I got a different plan for this plus I was using this like non-stop loading the whole truck had everything all decked up and waiting for me I got these main connections so hot it melted the plastic and the winch has been acting a little funky ever since then so let's see and I wasn't really thinking when I originally put this thing in here it's all welded on there so but seems to be working probably should have grabbed the socket but oh well we'll get it the other thing hopefully the uh, the audio turns out all right on this I uh, picked up a wireless lapel mic so trying that out so I hope the sound isn't too horrific I hope the sound isn't too bad when I'm doing this and I'm wearing a jacket too so guessing there will be some some noise I'll figure it out as we go along trying to uh, find a good spot to hook it up and so thought this would be as good a time as any to test the mic out well honestly I got <laughs> the winch and the mic delivered today so I'm uh, excited to tr try this all out. Yeah, I didn't remember for sure, but I think I cut the bolt heads off these and welded them down in the hole.
Got that up and out of there. Got this control box off. Oh, no. Have to take this hook back off. Get it back through. That fair lead. There we go. Just cut that off. Got a little dish of new ones in there. I got my ground just bolted on there and my Chucky pliers. <laughs> uh, Chucky 2009 recommended these. They're Niplex. They're actually really nice. Oh, wasn't paying attention. I might have to go searching for a nut. I had them stacked on top of this sideboard and looked up. I'm only seeing one of them. There we go. I can see the other one on the ground there. So, we got that. Part. So that does fit there. I don't want to waste this plate. So that tells me I can reuse this plate for uh, the other winch for the idea I have for it. And I will.
I had to just set it on top. It was uh, really close to these existing holes. That puts it really close to the backing plate I put on here. So, we're going to switch it up to guesswork. <laughs> what I did is I, I had a, the, the mark, but the existing hole in this plate, it was going to interfere with it. It was, uh, I don't think I could have got my hole in without catching into this, then that'd make a weak point. So I marked another one best I could, but then that put it too close to the, the main support. So now I split the difference and this should work. So. They had come countersunk a little, the actual plate. So I'll countersink them with one of these. I've found these bits to be really handy.
Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. That's that part done. So, unfortunately, it looks as if the uh, wireless microphone died at this point. I don't know if I charged it long enough to begin with or if that's just the end of the uh, battery life that this thing has. So, I'll have to keep that in mind and keep an eye on it. This was just the first time I used it. And there was a lot sped up here. It seemed to last for over half an hour. I could have even bumped it and turned it off I I don't know I'll pay closer attention to it but uh, you know I just wanna say thanks to the subscribers and you know the new ones the old ones and I hope everyone enjoyed this video feel free to comment with any questions you have um, I'll include links for the winch those niplex pliers in the uh, comment section down below uh, so feel free to check those out and you know anytime I throw the link in there it's the Amazon affiliate link I don't know how much you guys are familiar with that but if you click on that link and buy that item or if you click on that link and buy any other item on Amazon it costs you nothing extra but the channel gets a small kickback depends on what you order it's in between 5 and 10 percent um, on items so you know, if if you're gonna order something else, let's say, hey, you you want to order, uh, you know, a, a new shirt or something. If you click on that on any of those links and just search whatever you want to buy and buy it, costs you nothing extra. Channel gets a little kickback. So, thanks for watching. <laughs>